Hello and welcome back to Outer Worlds. Farbrook. Yeah, we're in Farbrook and we're heading out to... Wow, actually, unsure. Deal with Clive? Uh, probably the factory? I think the factory is the closest, but it's really hard to say. We're just heading uh, over here. Taking that road, maybe take, take, checking this out. And it seems like this is the, the closest place. So... Yeah. We're just gonna head out and uh, explore a little bit. Box windows. I actually might need to do a bit of selling, but yeah, I, I, maybe maybe it's fine. Am I going the right way? Nope. <laughs> wow, 500 meters. Again, Monarch is just so big. I don't want to say it's like, it's like big like a, uh, oh crap. Like the size of like, like New Vegas, obviously. Uh, it, it's smaller than that, but it's pretty damn big though. There's so many bandits on the roads. Tend to be fine. I don't really get hit that much. I, I don't really repair my armor. Actually, I kind of replace my armor usually. <laughs> One crossroads discovered for 2000. And uh, yeah, we're heading to Cascadia. Oh crap. We need some help with that. I can see you. And I won't have Okay. Mantis Serapis. Uh, we don't really have any markers to this place. Uh, this place doesn't really have any signs like Big Jerk Lab. Abandoned relay station. Mega Mantisaurs? Do we really need bigger Mantisaurs? Holy shit! There you go! You mean this attack me? Jeez. And they have nothing. Adrena time? I suppose this uh, devoured. At least one soldier. Unlucky chump. Nothing here. Maybe a vending machine. Yoshi box. Requires relay station access codes to unlock. We don't have that. But now, we just have to go away. <clears throat> but, at least we know that this place is here. I would like to run into some uh, friendlies too. Oh shit. So I said that. God. Some of them don't even drop their guns. A bit disappointing. I actually do prefer. Uh, enemies dropping everything. I think that's cool. Huh? 
Of course, it can be hard to balance, but I suppose the merchants can be always be dicks. Or, or just limit the carry weight, I suppose. Like, you're gonna like chuck home like 20 heavy armors. Well, that could be just annoying. Wow. Ah, uh, key codes. Key cards. We don't have. But how we get it? Abandoned safe house. This is just a point of interest. Not something we can uh, travel to. I still don't understand this whole fake window thing. Why? I'm just trying to come up with... Like, even if it was against the Raptodons, wouldn't you have, like, spotlights, maybe? I, I think it's just purely to make these uh, metal boxes. Because basically these are metal containers. Uh, more homey. And that maybe shouldn't be underestimated by me. But I might find a house without windows odd, but in the future, maybe not so much. Especially if it's like alien planet. Would you really want windows? Maybe so if it's like very uh, friendly, but you, you can never know. Like alien planets, it stands to reason that uh, humans, where will we go in the, pa in the future as humans? It's gonna be less suited. Food poisoning is one of the leading causes of death in Halcyon. Not surprising when you see these places. For human inside. habitation. Food poisoning is a leading cause. Can I just check this waterfall? Mm. Oh, I just uh, break into this without changing clothes. Teach me that. Oh fuck, whoa, look at that. So the Bors factory, so this is the sewer that I was uh, um, not told about. We have a choice, so many ways, and I, and I like this, so many ways to uh, solve missions. Oh my god, <clears throat> can I just talk to them? Can't go in here. Oh. Some bandits. Can pick a fight with them. I'm very far away. <clears throat> uh, maybe not do that. I might go for a drink. Should I just put on my helmet? Oh, um, maybe not. So let's drink and maybe just eat one thing. I still don't know what is food. Uh, sure, pass the pack. That's how you do it. Just so restricted access. I can't walk in there. They got the drop on it. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't want to do that. Holy shit! These guys are not kidding around. You see someone? Jumping, just jumping at the fence, at the fence, and like, I do this, no problem. If I lean forward one centimeter, fucking dead meat. Let's everyone kill him. And you don't have a chance to talk to these people. Corporate commander, you want to talk to me? No. We need an ID chip to get in here that I, I forgot to buy. But we can also sneak in. We can put our sneak uh, skill to the test. <clears throat> oh, 
I was a little hesitant to uh, consider breaking this to the, in, into this place, but how much they don't want me to break into this place? Really wants me to break into this place. Okay, we don't have an idea, but we might be able to steal one. Nice and easy. This is a weapon that's silenced. So we might be able to score some headshots. And we might be able to steal a ID of a guard. Chris Pig. So, two guards are talking over here. We saw one guard. Should have got spotted. It is possible that I kill this guard. Maybe something we'll consider. ID chip. Also, it's good to see that. <clears throat> Wait, I'm still undetected? I would like an ID chip. I don't think you're gonna. I think we can find special items in containers. Oh, ID chip. We got it. Only problem with the idea chip is that apparently it just runs out. I don't really get that. Medical 55. Increase the di daily vitamin administration to the Christy pigs feeding uh, trouts by. Oof. 400 um, 4,0 percent <clears throat> greetings authorized personnel the king would like to remind you of the following message the crispy pigs get five cans of borst per meal per day each not four not six not ten this is five precisely and I don't care how much they squeal at you or how pathetic looking they their sad eyes are <clears throat> if you over or under feed my stock I will carve each of your limbs away, then run your shrieking body through the machine. Dress will slow. Wow. <laughs> I guess uh, we're taking this guy out. Okay. We increased their <clears throat> food a, a tiny bit. Your uniform's looking real sharp. Stumbatten Ultra. These guys should die. Standard troop. CMP, maintenance request. <clears throat> Understand your priority to the cannery machine and fixing its near monthly clogs now. Did you did they ever find out what breed of critter keeps crawling in there? But I'm telling you, there's something lodged in the drain pipe beneath the Christopix uh, trow. Hard to see, but in the light, I almost swear it was some kind of bone. Anyway, the feeding tubes backing up, so I need you to look at it. Not tomorrow, not next week, today. <clears throat> okay. 
this is the the pig feeding area. You can also climb up. I saw a ladder. It, it ran out, but how do I recharge it? It somehow got recharged by my killing people. Or maybe it get it also gets recharged when we leave the restricted area. I know that. Unexpected. Down they go. My reputation decreased. For killing a thing can. Just where do you think you're sneaking to? Mm. Production line is that a way, you worthless gad about? Uh, oh, come on. You're gonna report me, are you? I'm darn well thinking about it. Please don't. Well, since you asked me real nice. Fine. I'll let it slide. But just this once, mind you. Got it. I don't know why I turned so murderous now. <gasps> I just say it's justified. It's not justified. God damn it. Just because. <laughs> I don't know. Well, apparently, I read these already, no? No, I didn't. I don't want to say I told you, but I did message you that writing was uh, on the wall back in April. Did I not? Oh, it's getting so long. Which, if you remember, is one of the reasons I beg you to please hurry in your decision making, which inadvertently and unfortunately stoke your ire at me for rushing you. But now everything I feared is coming to pass. CMPs abandoned Monarch with the others. The factory is in working order, but less and less of us keep uh, showing up for shifts. Cause, what's the point really? Never got my last two bit cards for wages owed, which means I can pay rent. <clears throat> Again, let alone sponsor your wastrel of a cousin gambling habits. I know how you titter it away whenever I raise these sort of concerns, but I'm not joking, Gaggy. It's only a matter of time before I'm plumb out in the streets. What are you going to do then? Keep telling me to wait? I can't. The next ferry is scheduled for Tuesday at 2 o'clock. I'll be on it, and I'll like you to join me. If you do, then I'll have your answer at last. If not, then I guess I'll have an answer at the same. Either way, I won't be waiting for another month on end. See you at the ferry platform, I hope. Yours in heart, if not body, fits. Would you really leave this? Wouldn't you tell them in person? I don't know. I, mean, I get it, like, the point is for me to see. <laughs> Restricted access. More restricted access. So that's the front entrance. Can we get in here? No, oh, it's sealed. That's the pig area. That's how it's called. Oh. 
I didn't even see the stairs. We got the back room. Also one stairs leading somewhere. Crap. The other one doesn't work. Okay. I only heard security so far. They not they signed up to get murdered. It's fine. Let's see what we can do. So I can hack. I can also talk. Hmm. Good question. <clears throat> I need to up my hacking. Enable pink slip protocol on Sentry Automax. Uh, maintenance logs. Uh, dictating memoranda from authorized user. Control room operator. Begin block quotes. <clears throat> oh, for piss and plasma. It, I ain't inputs. Start recording. Now did I? Now you stupid piece of scrap no computer. I was only saying how it irks me when the others... Filch my lunch. Very important. A uh, call elevated to the ground level. Can I tell them anything? Oh! Did the robots kill everybody? Fuck. So this place had a protocol about the robots killing everybody. And I triggered it by accident. Mind your head. Did everyone die? Wow. I'm still sneaking around. Okay. Uh, let's break it down. I think my carry capacity is fine. But I do need to shop and trade from time to time. Don't ask me more about it. Not where he can hear us. Had to sneak uh, this onto your data pad. Uh, delete after reading. Just be careful. All I know is Demi spied uh, Slaughterhouse Clive feeding the Sisties some questionable meat. Awful bloody with the uh, bones poking out of it. Says later she found a hand in the trough. She screamed. Now Demi's been downsized too, and the pigs keep getting fatter. So the pigs are eating humans. Clive's office key. A shovel? I don't think so. A 
can climb up, but let, let's just check out the first floor. Yet, uh, for now. Okay. Everybody died to the robots. Seems like getting uh, human murdering robots is easier than I thought. Standard troop armor gold. Okay. Well, let's climb up. Let's see if we can do something other than just like kill everybody. Where's the boss? I don't think he died in that slaughter. Increased production rate by 200%. The machinery cannot keep pace with the set rate. Risk of meltdown leading to a confined explosion is 99% likely to occur at this production rate. Well, the thing is, it's already turned off in a way. I don't see it working at all. Okay. Okay, let's bust in. Clive. What? No! I'm wearing the wrong armor. Let's wear that one. Put this on. Now, now we actually have the bonus that I really should have all the time. Use. Is it coming? Clive is not bothered by this. Hey Clive, uh, I'll kill you in a minute. Another lift. Okay, we'll take that. Clive, I know everything. What if I st steal? You're just gonna be get mad. Personal files. Who would have thought, am I right? Whole factory, ripe for the taking. Non-divisor, safe for me. And now the king, I reckon, who is also me but different. Better. I, I know it ain't wise, but to, to, to be so fanciful. But it grows so lonely. Just me and the pigs and the machinery. And now the king. The others will come soon, though. To work for me. The laborers. Gotta start small. But then we'll build and we'll feed... We'll feed and we'll feed. What? The king can scarcely believe how well, um, <clears throat> how awful, fine, it's all gone. I came from nothing, but now I'm a self made man. I don't know, I don't really care. I think I got it. Any personnel, and I don't care if they be line worker or janitor or us. Stars them. Christy Pig. We shall tell them to call the king by his rightful moniker and do it properly. None of this slaughterhouse Clive pig shit or I will show them a slaughter they won't ever forget. Did I make myself clear? Yes, marvelous. That I'll do it. Are these just pep talks he wrote himself on the computer? Hey, right, Clive! Are you ready to get shot in the face? I'll reload, just in case you would like three more bullets. 
Whoa, now. And just what do you figure you're doing up here? These are my private quarters, friend. I don't allow tours up here. I don't allow tours ever on deeper consideration. You got blood on your shirt. Right there. <laughs> Certain things require a mess to do well. See, I was just killing some time. I prefer to prepare my dinner by my own hand. Nothing like fresh and bloody borstwurst. Those are parts from Christy Pigs? I do own a factory known for specializing in the canning of borstwurst. On occasion, I like to imbibe other parts of the Sisty Pig. Did you fancy me a cannibal? Perish the thought. No, I don't eat the bodies, I disappear. A joke, that last was. So, what can I do for you? My full attention is at your disposal. Is he looking at me? Olaf, he is absolutely surely giving me the complete creeps. While I approve of your associate's cautious nature, I still teeter on the verge of losing my patience. Let us move forward with the present proceedings. Mate, why do you try to act cool? I don't get it. Oh, I am a butcher guy. Ooh. Is that a blind taste test in the other room? Sublight sent me to kill you, but I'm sure we can work something out. Let's ask about the taste test. Seems like he's going for like 60% heat letter joker or maybe 70%. I'm not sure what else, but it's mainly heat letter joker. Indeed it is. Did you partake no? of the experiment? I would like to hear your assessment. Of the quality of each sample, if so. Uh, I haven't. Not interested. Some other time, perhaps. Sublight sent me to kill you, but I'm sure we can work something out. By sublight, you mean Catherine, do you not? That greedy, star-crossed sow. Listen, friend. The Borst King of Monarch does not negotiate with coveters. How about you bring me Catherine's severed head and I will gift you a lifetime supply of Borst. Really? I already have a lifetime supply of food. What if you and Catherine partnered up, two great empires combined? Good deal? No, the best deal is that I kill you, I take over this factory and Catherine can suck it. I really, really won't feel bad about killing you. You can choke on your lifetime supply of borst. Piss! And I had hoped it might not come to this. Like true professionals. Borst factory reputation decreased. Is it really a? I think. Secondary. Boar's fa- <laughs> Oh man. Well, they don't like me that much. Sublight salvage and shipping. <sighs> I don't know. Do we take this? Why not, I suppose. I'm not sure where this leads. Oh, I need to sneak around. We can just head out. I'll probably get attacked by the guards. The guy's dead. That's it. We didn't really find out, find out too much. Actually, I don't think there was too much to find out other than he sometimes uh, feeds people to the boars. Nice 
This guy failed. Not the disguise. What? I'm carrying too much? I am. Uh, let's list by weight value. Wow. These are the worst. These are the best. Okay, let's break that down. I'm not getting rid of the light machine guns. Okay, let's list these by weight value. I don't have a lot. Okay, that's, that's crap. That's crap too. But mostly I don't want to destroy everything here. Oh man. So that's it. I own the Bors factory now. I can also kill these. Corporate commander. Good. Uh, maybe worth selling. Gate key. Uh, pff, fine. Take his helmet. Just to be thorough here. And we just did everything. Already pretty much I was committed to just taking these guys out. And I'm a little thirsty. Let's drink that. I should really go back to this one one of the towns and might as well just spend some skills would this go up wait no look at this after you go over 100 so we are now at 200 percent but if i go over 100 it only goes up by five percent wow so after 100, the efficiency drops significantly. But I'm not sure what else to put points in. I don't care about the perk, so that doesn't matter. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna go with 90. That's good enough. I'm not sure what else. So we got uh, 107 persuasion. <laughs> oh, that's good enough. Yeah, I, I probably should have never put that 5 points into that. I don't care to increase my sneak. Lockpick seems to be good enough, usually. Science. Increase uh, plasma and shock damage. Increases uh, corrosion and end rate damage. I don't know. Science doesn't really come up. Engineering doesn't really come up. So these are mostly... These don't, these don't really come up. Lockpick and hack. Those get checked the most. By far. I can also look into long guns. Deadly focus, no weapons way. For five minutes, five seconds after each kill. Eh. I don't really care. I can handle weapons way. So don't go over 100. And we might we might consider some base perks. I don't know. Like look at this. Like get chance to get basic mod. But the basic mods are so easily achievable. Another thing that could be interesting is chance. 20% chance items you repair will become pristine, increasing value and durability. Oh, only value and durability. Oh, I was kind of hoping that it, it, it gets better. Increases damage of plasma, shock, damage weapons. Higher science skill unlocks ability to tinker any weapon or armor in the workbench, increasing their power. But does it increase the, the tinker efficiency? Because that would be good to know. 
if I can tinker my weapons and armor to be stronger, and this also applies to the companions, this would be pretty good. But it also, se but it only seemed to uh, reduce the tinkering cost, which I just don't care about. I can also up my long guns, like 200% critical to... Yeah, it go, goes up a little bit. But it's kind of pointless unless we go to uh, 100. At which point it would ignore 100% ignore armor. But that might be too much. But science might be completely pointless. So I don't really know. Just going to 80 doesn't work, and if I go to... If I start putting points into long guns, I would need to put points into long guns till 25, kinda, to uh, really justify it. And any bonuses to long guns actually don't really matter that much. Actually, kinda lost. I'm not even sure how they get... Oh, caffeine drink. That That's the only way I get bonus for it. But usually we don't get bonus for it, so I think it's kind of fine. But the question is, like, are we good with the other skills? Is it good enough? Well, lockpick is certainly boosted by Parvati. That helps. Hack tends to be a weak link because we don't, we can't do that unless we have Sam or Vicar Max in the team. And Hack does play a role. Do I need to be better at fighting? Or should I just put points into Hack? Because it seems like a, a little crazy just to put points into Hack that actually I can I can boost by a lot. When I want to. Engineering, I can boost. Science, I can't boost that. Actually, I can boost that with Sam. With Sam, we can boost science. So, we can boost engineering, science, medical, lockpick, hack, and sneak. All these can be boosted. These can be boosted. But the problem is with this, like, 760 health. We push this up. And it's gonna be by 100. Goes up by 100. But the companions have 3000 HP. So, the impact of the termination just becomes smaller and slow, uh, smaller. Which is a bit of a bummer. I would rather see. I would like to see this as a percentage. Because early game, this doubled their health. Or maybe even more than doubled their health. But now, it's just 25% of their health. So, it's just not worth it. And I guess the base skill unlocks kind of play a role. But it's not really worth putting more than 60 points in it. That's my uh, conclusion. No oh, crap, I don't want to put points in dialogue. Also, we don't have to heavily invest in dialogue either, because those can be... Yeah, those can be... Uh, boosted by companions too. I don't think that doesn't get boosted is the long guns. I guess I guess we can just try how strong we can get. If I boost the long guns. Also, of course, my perception is not, not the highest. That that a little bit uh, limits. If I had max perception and max intelligence, then I would have the, the best... Uh, um, the most powerful guns. But like this, it's still going to be fine. I think we're just going to go with long guns here. And uh, let's go with that. And we have to go back, trade, and might as well return the mission. Let's go to Fallbrook. To be fair, I'm not gonna run a pick factory. So... Yeah, I guess... The thing is, what would be a, a fair reward for... <laughs> for giving them access to the big, a pick factory? Okay, maybe my speed okay. Now some Mason is not uh, dealing with me. Sublight Tug. You seen Arthur today? Now there's a woman who knows what she wants. Let's like talk. Her. 
Ellie. You know I mean, not Ellie. Uh, Captain Mallard. Please say the Yoda corpse you're wearing is Clive's. Good news. I butchered Clive and threw a wrench in the machinery. <laughs> I did both. And when you destroyed my machinery, was it before or after you killed Clive? Because you understand, if it was after... On second thought, don't even tell me. We'll just say I'm doubly grateful. Though there is no double reward. Still, this ought to compensate for your troubles. And take an aromatic. You stink like Sisty Pig. I found one of your sublight supply runners hiding in a cave. What? I just got 2,000 bits for that? Wow. I found... yeah, yeah. I'll presume you mean Arthur. The one you sent scurrying back like a sprat with his tail cut off? Reckon I'm happy he's alive? I'd be happier if the marauders who botched my drop were dead. Alright. So let's see what we got. Speak with the information broker at Devil Speak, which is quite far away. Actually, not super far away now. But we would still need to uh, travel a little bit. Secret lab in Cascadia. I'm getting closer. At Scylla. Uh, this is Scylla too. Visit uh, Hayes Grave with Neoka. So this might be a time to actually get back Neoka. Uh, that's a Parvati quest. And another uh, mission uh, regarding Scylla. So, I need to trade, at least with a vending machine, and sell stuff. Okay, let's just sell. But well, we gotta make some money, right? Value, weight, ratio. And these, for some reason, are not worth a crazy amount, but those are the best weapons. I just leave those for last. So I'll sell. I, I, I guess they have a, uh, a disadvantage. I can just. Uh, I don't care. I don't. I don't use melee. They're not super accurate. Maybe I'm just gonna sell too. Let's see the armors. Uh, we can sell one of those. Tech skills is needed. Sell, sell. Stealth skills. Actually, I have two stealth skills one, no? Ah, uh, crap. Damage to creatures. Nah. Wait. What am I wearing? Okay. I also got this plus fifteen engineering Googles just in case. Oh, I also need to sell the trash. Hold Z to sell junk. And this leaves me with 122. That means that... Look at this. It's consumables. And maybe this. This crap. Let's see if we can sell it. Some of it that I will never use. Shock might get used. Crit damage can get used. Plasma can get used. That might get used. That's crap. Uh, that's kind of crap. I don't know. Diagnose is kind of cool. Physical armor rating. So this is just better than the other one. Yeah, we can sell that. But I guess we can also use that as like, hey, why not? Tech skills 5. Yeah, anything that's media related gets sold. I do like the silver tongue. 
TPB doesn't matter. Tog doesn't matter. Carrying capacity. I guess we can just put that in. Backpack. Same thing. Why is it listed different uh, separately? Reactive, reactive kina, kinematic shield projector. Yeah, that's this is good. That's good. Super scooper. Well, okay, them. Uh, can I just lose by weight? Anything that's super heavy here? Not really. I don't know. Fine. This is good enough. Space is yours. So I would need to mark the next location we had to. And we might yeah, I think there's a decent argument to be made just to going back. Probably maybe not resting, but uh simply just picking up Neota and uh just doing her quest. But we got a very awkward swap here. Okay. I don't really like this. I, as I said, like there's a very simple solution to this. So, you gonna wear that. Wait. Yeah, you wear that. And Ellie is going to wear this it's fine neoka that's just fine maybe plasma is, is is a better type of damage why not the dps is very similar so we can rest so before we head out before you pull you anticipate I'm anticipating it. What if I shoot a friend on accident? That's on account of your stance. <laughs> you want to lean into it. Embrace it. Work with it. You're in control here, Parvati, not the gun. Don't let a hunk of metal jerk you around. You've been around powerful machinery all your life. And you're always in control, right? I guess that's kind of like when the filler's shooting 600 cans of near molten sal tuna down the conveyor while I'm trying to tune a belt. Here, stand like me. Just so. Hip square. Lean forward a little. It's just equipment, and you're just an engineer using it. Ah! Okay. We'll try again later. You'll get it. I promise. What? Cool, but Parvati doesn't need any lessons shooting a gun. <laughs> you should know this shit, Nioka. Good to see you, boss. Wow. But we really don't have a lot of conversation options with Felix. Ellie? I would like to know Something about you, mind? too. I, is there a reason they're not opening up to me? Oh, man. It's hard to say. Maybe I should look into it, but I don't want to spoil myself. Uh, we're going to... No, I already explored the first conversation option. Captain, and, uh... I was hoping for a word. You were? Where are you? Can you just come to me? I want to thank you for talking some sense into me back there with Cheney. It has been a long time since I gave in to my... violent enthusiasm. Cut the crap, Max. You lied to me about Cheney, and I want to know why. Never mind that. Why did you feel the need to lie to me about Cheney? I don't really want to bring it up, though. I don't. I don't want to know about prison. Never mind that. Why did you feel the need to lie to me about Cheney? Okay, it was pretty clear. You're right. I owe you an apology. 
I've been so obsessed for so long, I couldn't see anything else. You offered me a place on your crew, friendship, and I used you to get to Cheney. And even then, you saved me from myself. I don't know if I could live with myself had I gone through with it. You owe me nothing, I know, but I... I'm begging your forgiveness. I understand. We all get a little obsessed sometimes. You're forgiven? Yeah, I'm pretty forgiving. Just don't make a habit out of it, okay? Okay, but I'm watching you. You, even, you ever lied to me again about anything? You're out. Uh, I don't think so. You're not welcome on my crew anymore. Pack your things. I understand. We get a little obsessed sometimes. You're forgiven. For now. No, no, no. I'm, I'm gonna say that. Like, he has a chance. Like, if, if after this, he again abuses my trust, then, like, okay, you didn't, you didn't trust me. I, I can actually just, uh, I can forgive that. Not, not a problem. Although it's a little annoying. But, sure, you're forgiven. Thank you. I promise I'll be nothing but truthful from this point forward. Yeah, exactly. Like me uh, intimidating him or just giving him an ultimatum. Um, I don't think that would get me any closer to what I want. What was it like being in prison? Oh, exactly as you'd imagine. Can't say I enjoyed the stint. It did provide me with plenty of time to think. The way I see it, the universe was snapping me back to where I needed to be. You stray too far from the course of your destiny. The world will try to correct for it. You know, I don't care for this. Alright, let's move. Alright. Let's head out. So it seems like if I'm not told to... Or like not asked by the companions. Or not told by the game to interact with the companions. Then it's just really no point me trying that. Because... There's nothing to do. Like, I want you off the ship, or I'm leaving. That's that's the option. Oh, uh, maybe we can fast travel. So that's Neoka. But should we go there first? So this is a uh, devil speak. We might go there first. Uh, I just go to the factory, and we're not gonna bring Ellie. Come on, Ellie! I am giving you a chance to open up to me, and she's not doing it. Felix is not doing it. I don't know. Is it just time based? Is it like location based? Is it just uh, I don't know how it works. Uh, seemingly we crashed. Odd. And we're back. So... Wow, the sublight guys moved in fast. <laughs> hey, what's up, mates? Oh, fuck? Restrict to the access? No way! I basically own this place. It better not lock me out. Also, I want a, a share of the profits. I call this rotting river on account of all the dead things I've thrown in it over Maybe the like years. 20%. It'll take you into the Devil's Peak Caverns if you follow it under the bridge. That's one option. Others, the slope up. If you're up for some fun, let's chat. You want to chat? Okay, we have multiple options. Interesting. Anyway, this is a good time to take a break. Thanks for watching again. See you next time.